Hi everyone, it's Ted at the Homes Team with William Ravis Real Estate. So if you've lived in your home for several decades and are considering selling, you might be wondering, how do I start the process and where do I even begin? Over the years, I've helped many clients through this exact process. And while it can seem overwhelming, it doesn't have to be. Here are a few things to consider. First, what do you do with all the personal items you've accumulated over the years? Let's be honest. If you've lived in your home for more than a decade, you've likely gathered a lot of stuff. Start by deciding what to take with you, what your family or your kids might want, and then categorize what to sell, donate, recycle, or remove. Starting this process may seem tough, but trust me, once it's done, it's liberating. Second, if your home feels dated, don't worry. Major renovations aren't always necessary. And when you begin those renovations, it's hard to decide where you're gonna stop. I suggest pricing your home based on its current condition while focusing on deferred maintenance, like leaky pipes, a leaky roof, or broken windows. Buyers appreciate a home in solid functioning condition and they can handle the cosmetic updates themselves. Third, don't let the new property disclosures required by the state overwhelm you. Start by listing everything you know about the property. What have you improved? anything you've done over the years, and make sure you write down anything you can think of. Your agent can help you complete the disclosures and ensure that nothing gets missed. When you are interviewing agents before you list your home, be sure to ask them what they're going to do to help you prepare the home for market. What happens before the home is listed is crucial to a quick sale at the best price. If you have any questions about buying or selling, please contact me anytime. Thanks for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.